making this as a response to some things that Dendrophilian has said uh, in a recent video about pedophilia. Uh, he asserts something about children only being upset about sexual abuse uh, later when they grow up because they find out that society thinks that it's wrong. I have a degree in social work and have been involved in several group therapy sessions with survivors of sexual abuse. And even before they had a name for what was happening to them, uh, before they had any idea what society thought of it, they were outraged, they were furious, and they were fearful that someone did something to them that they did not want to be done. Uh, Dendrophilian, I believe, said that the child's ability to consent to this, uh, something about it not being an issue, I've observed that it has always been an issue, a big issue, when somebody does something to someone that they don't want to happen to them. Uh, and they act out on it, on this rage and this fury about it in many ways, males and females, from ways from disruption in the workplace and in families to murder, reenacting the abuse over and over again, trying to kill the person that did it, trying to stop it, something that's already happened. And there's not much sympathy for any of this in society. Uh, people say, very often I've heard, you know, they don't care that this person was molested when they were six. There's no excuse for murdering 40 people and I'm not going to judge them because I'm not a judge but it is obvious that the damage is done and that they cannot be allowed to go out and murder 40 more people because they were molested when they were six. People think often contrary to what society wants them or tells them to think. Uh, Often, this is based on at least some perceived mistreatment of themselves or other people. This is one reason we have Renaissance and Reformation, Revolution. Someone stands up and says, this is wrong. And other people go, you know, you're right, I've been thinking that, what do we do about it? And someone leads them in a charge against the wrong. That will happen with this, at least by the people who feel wronged by it. So there'll always be someone to fight it tooth and nail. There'll always be someone to fight it.